Hello. Come in. Hi. Hello. I'm Roxanne. What? What? Lovely What's to meet you. Name? James, come in. <laughs> Have to excuse the glasses, they're quite. Budget? It's fine, it'll taste good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it all goes down the same hole. Do you paint? I do paint. Yeah, I... I have painted. I'm not, like, the best painter. Is so, it, like, a naked body over there? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not mine. It's of a female form, yeah. So he's an artist, but have they made a good impression on each other? I think he likes girls with very big boobies looking at his paintings, so I do not know what to make of that. <laughs> but it's, he's artistic, which is good. I'm slightly worried what she thinks about the boob pictures. Um... I'm not gonna lie, um, they are pretty weird, I think, for, <laughs> for any girl. I'm gonna try and give her the most rounded, golden, beautiful coloured ones. Keep your mind on the cooking, young man. It, oh, it is. Guacamole and salsa, then the South American croquette starter is served. Ooh. Here you go. <laughs> I'm very excited to try this. I love guacamole. Mmm. <laughs> yeah, I like is it. That? I like your Fresh. guacamole, yeah. They both dig in, and Roxanne digs a little deeper. Based on your menu, I thought you were going to be a Brazilian musician. Really? Yes. Well, that is probably what I aspire to be. Yeah. I, believe, I do believe in reincarnation, so... Oh, wow. Well, I don't actually, but I think if, if I did, that would be uh -huh. the person I'd probably want to aspire to be. Ah, but it'd be a shame to waste his talents as a painter. Is this your ideal body type for a woman, or...? I'm a fan of the torso. <laughs> Not so much of a fan of the arms. They're very skinny compared to the rest of her body. <laughs> yes, what I mean. That's what needs to be improved. It's an unfinished painting. Yeah. Um, please don't judge me this quickly. No, no, it is very good. I it's am impressed. It's not finished. <laughs> and neither is the starter, but Roxanne's had enough. That was really delicious. Uh, you do a good guacamole. I'm Thank excited you. to try the next ones. Yeah, we'll see. We're just going to get the steaks on. Thank you. There you go. This looks very nice. You must have worked hard. I did. <laughs> you did. Oh. <laughs> or medium rare, just how I like it. Is that actually? Yes. Mm. Very nice. That is good. You know it's good. <laughs> and James is pretty sure of something else, too. You're quite posh, aren't you? No. Are you not? <laughs> no. I'm really not. <laughs> That's so mm. funny. I'm not like, oh, darling. I'm not like that, am I? No. No, Sorry, how? You a little bit. No. Do you want to go on a second date? <laughs> a garnish of raspberries and the Brazilian chocolate puddings are served. Oh, wow, that's so <laughs> big. I won't be able to I... fit out of your door frame <laughs> after Really? I'll tell you, don't finish it. Mmm. <laughs> that's nice. That's so rich. It's really the richest yeah, thing I've ever eaten. It's quite hard to, like, dunk this. <laughs> Can you imagine trying to eat the whole one of those? I don't want any more, though. Mm -mm. Yeah, I need some more. <laughs> Just... <laughs> yes. Well, they did their best, but it seems it's past James's bedtime. I'd love to have you here for a bit longer, but I want to give these other guys a bit of a chance. So <laughs> okay. I think it's time you we, we reconvened okay. later on in the week. I agree. I've had a lovely time. I don't know if A handshake? A handshake? <laughs> that sounds like it's, it's a business. business it's like a business talk. Let's give that another go. Thank you very much. I've had a lovely day and it was lovely to meet you. Me too. See you later. See you later. Goodbye. So what did Roxanne make of her first dinner date? There's something I fancy about him, but he isn't my usual type, but maybe that's a good thing. James definitely wasn't a Brazilian musician, but he was still a fun, artistic guy. So I was still very interested in the kind of person he was. I have no idea what she would have thought about me. I've got weird paintings up on my walls. Would she have seen the funny side of those? I don't know. I think there's more to Roxanne than probably what I saw tonight. So, yeah, I don't see why I wouldn't want to see her again, definitely. Hi. Very nice to meet you. I'm Ollie. Nice to meet you. That's you. Thank you. Come in. Thank you very much. So how long have you lived down here for? Um, I don't actually live here. This is my friend's flat. Oh, OK, OK, <laughs> so. boring. So you're not the one who plays the PlayStation, are you? I don't, do you? Not one of my, not one of my pastimes. Well, I don't do that either. Mm. Would you like a glass of Prosecco? I would love one. Yes, please. <sighs> here we are.
Thank you very much. Cheers. Cheers. Whereabouts are you from? Um, I live in Chelsea. OK, OK. I'm down in Fulham, just next uh, to... Uh, OK. Like... Shall we have some starters? That'd be fantastic, yeah. Stop it. Blimey, that was speedy. But do either of these two want to go steady with each other? She seems a bit nervous. I've tried my hardest to maintain a conversation, but it's all a bit... Hitting traffic straight away. I'll give some time, I'm sure she'll open up as the evening goes on. And I'm looking forward to having some food. I'm absolutely starving. Initially, not the kind of guy that I normally go for. Uh, he seems really nice, though, so maybe we'll have some things in common and that'll kind of spark things up a little bit. Hi, Hi. how are Sasha. you? Hi, Stephen, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Come on in. Uh, this is for you, but... Thank you. Um, yeah, do you want to start with red? Do you want to do white? We have prongs to start, so wait, yeah, cool. let's do that. Thank you. White it is. Stephen grabs a bottle and they're off. What do you do uh, for a living? Uh, recruitment. Recruitment, OK. Do you, do you want a hand with that? No, I think, I think I'm good. Are you London born and bred or...? No, if I'm Paul in Dorset. I don't know if you know South Coast. Uh, Dorset is, um, is that Cornwall? It's on the way. Gotcha, OK. Very nice. What about you? Uh, I'm originally from Florida. You sure that you have? <laughs> Should be all right. So what do you do? Well, he's not a bartender. Management consulting. OK. There we go. Success. <laughs> Bet that's worked up a first. Cheers. Cheers. Nice to meet you. You too. So he finally got that bottle opened, but as Stephen slinks off to sort his starter, do they pop each other's corks? He's not short, so that's a positive. Um, he's tall, maybe not quite my type. Um, he seems a bit nervous, maybe a bit awkward, but maybe just nervous. Yeah, she seems really nice. She seems uh, bubbly, um, good sense of humour, pretty, seems easy to talk with, so, yeah. Hey, you all right? Hello. Sasha. Hi, Sasha. Nice to meet you. You too, all right. Hey. Come in. Get you a bottle of wine. Oh, nice one. Cheers. Hope you like whites. Thank you very much. Thank you. Are those flowers for me too, or are they just decoration? Well, you can take them after if you like, but I thought of a yeah, bit of decoration. I'm joking. So, looking forward to tonight's menu. Maybe uh, it's up to scratch. <laughs> so, find out. Please let him get that bottle open easily. Phew! Right, cheers. Cheers. Just a lovely evening. All right. Good to meet you. You too. Psst, Mark, you're staring. So I'm sure you're hungry, so I'd better get this uh, start sorted. Perfect, thank you. It's a nervous start. The starter is served. Thank you. It smells good. I think it's all right, but we'll soon find out. Are you going to poison me? I don't think so. Let's hope not. Either way, Sasha gets straight to work. So, how long have you been single? Coming on 18 months now. Is that... Could you rate yourself highly? I mean, out of 10, what would you rate yourself? So, I, I think I'm, like, middle of the road. I said about six or seven. I don't want to... Six don't want to blame, seven? I don't want to blame my trumpet too much. I think it's... <laughs> I'd probably rate myself at, like, an eight or a nine. OK. So, um... <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> You're quite funny. Thanks. But there's one thing she just can't resist. So jumper kind of matches the tomatoes. <laughs> Is red your favourite colour? I think my red jumper's quite dashing. <laughs> Do you like Christmas? Who doesn't like Christmas? <laughs> Top of the jumper. All right. <laughs> <laughs> but I've got Christmas jumpers with flashing lights on it. I do too. I'm a massive fan of Christmas jumpers. In December. <laughs> The mousse is given a sprinkling of chocolate and it's joined by the champagne cocktails. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, oh gooey, gooey, gooey cheers. Oh, like. <laughs> what sort of cocktail would you go for normally? Quite like a, a woo woo or a cosmopolitan, something very girly. What sort of thing would you, you think I'd go for normally? Porn star martini. Porn star martini? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely not a porn star martini. Wrong diagnosis there. It's not very moosey at all. It's a good non-moosey moose. Good. It tastes good. Well dodged. James, you've got uh, salted caramel on your nose. <laughs> oh, no. They're embarrassing. Have you got a napkin, potentially? That I could, a uh, napkin? Uh, How old are you? Well, something... something to... Rub harder. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> 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 
have to get a tissue, like, for your okay. mother. So, uh, I'm sorry about that. <clears throat> That's a bit embarrassing. What's worse, having insulted caramel nose or having your date wipe it off? Uh, your probably both. And with that, it's time for James to nosy on home. Right, well, no, nice to meet you. Bye-bye, nice lovely to meet you. To meet you. you too. Mwah. So, yeah, say goodbye to the rest of the family. I will <laughs> the two be. cats, very nice to meet you. Um, thank you very much for the food. Thank you very much. Thank you. You Bye. too. So what did James make of his second dinner date? Cordelia, maybe not naturally my time. I tend to go for blondes, but she was really nice. I think a GP is, I think, is amazing as well. I could uh, definitely see myself may maybe fancying her. This is, this is definitely a possibility. It's true. Ooh. James was very friendly, very easygoing, which is great, and I, I really like that about him. If he asked me to go on another date, then, you know, I'd be up for that and see how things went, really. <laughs>